So today we will be moving clutches of bladder snail eggs into a hatching tank full of dechlorinated water with some money wart for um for filtration and I actually you know let me move my camera. phone camera. Hello Pepper. Okay. Okay, I had to use I had to use a salt shaker to hold my phone in place. Okay. So there's a clutch right there. That's part. Trying to get it to focus. There you go. That. There's a clutch. There's one. There's one. And there's one. And there is one of the three. Wait, there's one, two, three of the possible parents. Yeah. This is the creek tank with wild caught plants and some plants that I got online. They laid eggs on one of them. So, let me put this back in here. I'm going to be carefully removing them with an old ID from a few years ago. Because it's been a few days, so they've hardened and they're able to be carefully picked up. They're just like jelly with more jelly inside of it, but the jelly happens to be a living thing. Oh, that smells bad. That That's normal though, because it came from Riverwalk. Yeah, I don't need a light. <laughs> if I knock over the camera, I'm not going to be able to fix it. Because my main priority is the snails, not the filming. So I'm checking. There's there, there, there. I'm going to try to remove two clutches. I'm going to leave this one in place. And that one on the plant, but I'm going to try to remove that one and that one. I have more hope for this one than the other one. But this one, I can just pick up, move, and carefully snap off the bit of plant. I can't see what I'm filming. Here is the egg. Can't stay out of water for more than a few seconds. Step one, done. Try to get my camera to sit still. Okay. So the other one is right there. The water surface looks bad, but okay. Let's try this carefully. God. Oh no! Oh no, they're sinking. No, and they're at the bottom of the tank. That's okay. I can still get them out. I need... You know, I wonder... No. <laughs> it's gonna be fun. Thankfully, none of them got squished. They're all intact. They're just at the bottom of the tank now, where their parents may eat them. So I'm gonna pause this and find something to carefully get them out with. Okay, so I have the end of a tank sponge and a cleaned pill bottle lid. This is gonna be fun. I can't even see them. They are lost. I mean, they'll survive in the tank. Um, okay, let's try to remove the other one instead. <laughs> because this is about 50% natural water and about 50% dechlorinated tap water. So, they should be okay in either of them. Uh, oh, there's another clutch. Right there. Okay. So for that one, I'm going to put this under it. I don't know how in focus I am. I'm going to put this cap under it to catch them. I know you can't really see what I'm doing, but snails are more important than the camera angle. Carefully scoop them. Got him. There, right there. 
hard to see, but that's okay. I gotta try to scoop them out without getting any water, which I can actually do with a clamshell. Let me put this on autofocus. This clamshell is clean. I picked it up at the same place I got them. Carefully scoop the eggs. And I'm going to set them on this plant so they have something to exist on. There we go. I think that's it. Are they in? Yep, I think so. Okay. Let's see if we can find him. So, there's the one we transferred in. And the others are invisible. Oh dang. I know they're in here. Well, you know, probably still in the clam cell, clam shell. So I'm gonna put the clam shell in there. But I know for a fact they are in there. Two clutches in there. Hello. And I'll scrape off a little bit of cuddle bone for them. Okay, so there's still uh, that one. Wait, that one. The clutch right there. And probably several other small ones in the tank. Oh yeah. There's another one right there. You know, actually, I'm gonna try to get you two. Because the sooner you can be adapted to fresh water, the better. Oh! You gotta clean the surface of the water? Yeah. Oh! You float it up. You want a surface too? They can float upside down on the surface to, to clean the top of it. You can see his little mouth moving. And he is trying to get. And he is trying to turn himself upside down. Okay, let me pause this. He is also going onto the surface. Why don't you focus? This entire thing has probably been out of focus, sorry. Now I'll try to get that set of them right there that you can see above water. You're there! Another clutch. This one's a day old. But it's had plenty of time to dry and harden, so it's safe. And in about two to three weeks, Baby snails. So there they are, on that leaf. Resting. Growing. Existing. Three clutches. Successfully transferred. Two or three more still in here with new clutches being laid every day. And, um, <coughs> a clutch currently in the making.